Hey everyone, I'm Lucky Chaos. This is a cheap game review. Every week we look at a new release in Steam, costing $5 or less. Today we're looking at Magic Rampage. It came out May 24th. It's free to play from the Steam store. An exciting platformer that combines the RPG genre with fast paced action gameplay. So it's apparently a port of a mobile game. I never got around to play the mobile game, so let's jump in and check it out. Alright, so there are quite a few uh, classes to choose from. I'm going to go with a Black Mage. They've all got different stats, I assume different attacks and stuff. Who knows, let's go with Black Mage, see what we got. I'm assuming you're friendly. Hey you, soldier. What the hell happened to those guards? I don't know. They were attacking me, yeah, I see that. How about you give me a weapon? That'd be cool. There we go. All right. Go wash your face. It looks awful. I probably should have got that before I jumped down. Or I can go backwards. Achievement unlocked, zombie killer. All right, simple enough. <laughs> Secret area zero of two. I guess I missed some stuff. All right. Secret area discovered. Now that I know to look for them. That was close. Not really. Thanks for the help. Take this sword. You will need it. Alright. Oh, that was stupid. Okay. Not too hard to find the secret areas when you know what you're looking for. Oh, I'm not paying attention. Oh, okay, break this one. Move this one, got it. Yeah, it worked. Aim for the head for critical damage. Yep, figured that one out. Oh. I uh, wasn't paying attention. Was there... Yes. But no message that I got a secret area, which is strange. Bonus level. I can't attack. Okay. Oh, already lost out on one. Can I? Nope. All right. Well, that's. Mm. Yeah, that one's screwed.
Okay. <clears throat> Messed up the beginning, but... Oh, we got a shop. Half my inventory has been wrecked. Prices are higher. Okay, so there's there is a cash shop. So three bucks for eighty thousand. I've gotten fifteen thousand so far. All right, so this is the first time I'm seeing the shop, but initial impressions: things don't seem to be priced so high that you absolutely need to buy gold. So that's good. I have no idea if that's consistent, but at least first time looking, that doesn't seem too bad. And another prize room. All right, I'm gonna try to get to the end of dungeon one, just cause I'm frankly just getting kind of bored. But I'd at least like to see a boss fight or something. I assume there's gotta be something like that. There we go. Whoops, ooh, hey. There we go. Just trying to get that off. Alright, that wasn't exactly exciting. Alright, here is the skill tree. Awake. Ten points left to distribute. We've got force, wisdom, and courage. Enhanced velocity. Fearless jump, unstoppable strength. All right, just gonna check out survival mode real quick, see what that is like. Whoops. Assuming I can't go that way. I'm just kind of stuck in this tiny arena where they just drop two enemies at a time. Okay, that's enough of that. It started to get a little exciting towards the end, more enemies getting dropped in, but I'm not interested enough to play it anymore. All right, so that's it for Magic Rampage. Uh, overall, I just don't think it's a game for me. I like the art style, it looks cool. It plays fine, there's no issues with how it plays. It's just boring. I mean, for me, I guess a lot of people seem to be a fan of it. I don't know how much of that is maybe nostalgia. I like the art style. It plays fine. It looks good. I just... it was just boring. It seems to have nothing but positive reviews. I'm not sure how much of that is maybe just like nostalgia. People loved the game back... I guess it, I just looked it up. It came out in 2014 for mobile. So I don't know, maybe just people that played it really love it, which... which, I mean, yeah, that's the thing. There's plenty of old Nintendo games that are garbage if you've never played them but i look back on fondly and play still to this day but coming into this as a new player it's just boring i really was not interested in playing it i played to the end of dungeon one just to see a boss just to see you know it, things got much different but meh overall it's not a bad game it's just not a game that i enjoyed at all and it didn't seem like they push the microtransactions down your throat too hard, and they didn't even really seem necessary. You could easily farm enough gold to get whatever you want, so that that part at least wasn't too bad. But for the most part, there's just not enough here to keep me interested. Just got really boring. All the levels kind of just feel the same. You do a little bit of minor platforming, you throw whatever weapon you have equipped at whatever enemy is in front of you, and that's it. So overall, Magic Rampage, it's gonna be a thumbs down for me. I just, there's lots of better games to spend your time on. That's my opinion anyway. I don't make any claim that these reviews are unbiased, I just play games and let you know what I think of them. And I did not care for this one. To be honest, when I first saw the title for the game, I immediately jumped to uh, the old arcade game Rampage. We had like Godzilla and uh, Godzilla and Donkey Kong, although they weren't called that because of copyright, but 
a big monkey, a big dinosaur, and that kind of stuff, just destroying buildings. Uh, and I was kind of hoping it was going to be something like that, and now that it's not, I kind of want to go try to find that game, if that exists. Kind of just has me itching to play Rampage now. Alright, that's it for Cheap Game Review this week. We look at a new release in Steam, costing $5 or less every week. If that sounds interesting to you, please hit those like and subscribe buttons. Jump down in the comments, let me know what cheap games you're playing. If you played this one, what you think of it, and if you're coming into it fresh, or if you're coming into it having played the mobile version. Anyway, that's it for now. I am Lucky Chaos, and I'll catch you next time. Later.